Hello and welcome back. So in the last video, you saw the activity life cycle. The thing is, uh, we didn't look at two methods, the on pause and the on resume method. So in this video, I want to talk about these two methods in the life cycle and where they come into picture. So suppose you have an app open on your mobile phone and it gets partially, um, it, it becomes like partially visible for some time. Uh, then you can tap on the app and it becomes visible again. But for some time it's either overshadowed by another app or it goes in the background. So in that case, the on pause method comes into picture. So if you see this diagram, uh, so you, we, we already saw the on start method. Now what happens is whenever your app is running, activity is running basically, so now it becomes partially visible. So the on pause method is called the life cycle method. And then when it again becomes visible, then the on resume method gets called. Okay, so this lets you handle things in a better way. Say when the app is partially hidden, you want some certain functionality to stop. Like say you have a timer and you want it to stop for, for that duration like you have the Nike running app and those apps. So while it's partially hidden or it's in background, you, you don't want the timer or the stopwatch to run. So in those cases, you can make use of the on pause method. So in the code, what happens is uh, we overwrite the on resume and the on pause method. And you can do, you can write your code to handle these two methods. So this is the scenario in which um, the activity on pause and on resume methods are called uh, and I hope you get an idea about it. So try it out from your end, add some log statements and run the app on your mobile phone and then try to partially, you know, open multiple apps. I, I can show you in some later video how to do that, but go ahead and try it out and I'll see you next time. Okay, bye.